What's up guys? Welcome back. This is Sweeviver. I'm finally home again from the United States Roadshow with Pimax. We showed you the Pimax 8KX, the Pimax 8K Plus, the Artisan, the 5K Super and I think most of you were super impressed about the 8KX first of all because this is the flagship from Pimax and it's getting shipped in a couple of weeks from now after Chinese New Year. It's very exciting times now. If you were at CES 2020 with us, you saw all the awesome impression we got from people over there, some reviewers, some YouTubers and people and VR enthusiasts in general. They were all super excited about the 8KX. Also during our two meetups we had in the United States, in Florida and in New York, the visitors were super excited, especially by the 8KX with the 4K per eye resolution, the wide field of view and the immersion never seen in VR before. Anyway, this video will be about the 8KX and extensions cable for it, which works in the native 4K resolution per eye mode. Well, it's not as easy as you might think. I have tried many, many cables, but I finally find one which is working in both two and three meters. Before we begin, I would like to ask you to join my channel or subscribe to my channel because there's gonna be a lot of 8KX or Pimax content coming up. It's been a while since I did some videos and I will do other videos as well, Oculus Rift, Oculus Quest or wherever. Yeah, I'm finally home at least and I can finally start to do some cool content here. So subscribe now and I hope you're gonna enjoy it. Also, thank you to all my patrons and my official sponsors on Patreon, Commander Darklight, Art Armin and VR Ambassador. So guys, let's talk about the extension cables. It wasn't really easy to find working solution to extend above five meters while doing the native VR mode on the 8KX. The native mode is 4K per eye resolution, which is basically 3840 times 2160 pixels per eye, which is quite a high bandwidth. So, well, I tried different cables. I tried cables from eBay, I tried cables from my local shop, none of them worked. Also, I tried one of these cables, which are super expensive. This is the only confirmed cable to be working with the HP Reverb, a two meter extension, very thick, very shielded. Well, guess what? It didn't work either. During the roadshow in the United States, I finally found a cable which is working. Look at this, guys. This is the Club 3D extension cable with DisplayPort 1.4 support. It has HBR 1.2 or something support and it is supporting the DSC, which is a digital combat, uh, no, digital signal compression, digi <laughs> wait a minute digital stream compression. Well, yes, it actually supports that and it makes the 8KX work with the native mode. Well, here's the thing. Most of you might not even need an extension cable. I know because if you have a small space, if you have like a two times two meter room scale area, if you have your computer close to your space, then you probably get, can get away with a five meter cable, which is included with the Pimax 8KX. But for me in my space, I have a roughly two and a half times two and a half meters of room scale area, but the computer is actually around two meters away from this area, which leaves me with less than three meters to work with while doing VR gaming. And this doesn't really work for me. As you can see in my play space, the cable barely reaches the end of the room and well, this is not a great solution if you want to play some fast action shooters or any kind of uh, VR room scale gaming. Well, with this cable, with the Club 3D cable, which by the way, this is not a commercial, this is not advertisement. I don't even know this company. They have no idea I'm actually doing this video, but I'm super happy to announce that 8KX actually works with uh, DCS, DSC <laughs> compression and everything just works fine. If I use the two meter cable, I get two more meters extra to play around with. And that actually gives me a super nice VR room scale experience without any hassle of the cable. But I must say a three meter cable actually gives me even more, one more meter 
which will even give me a few more turns before the cable tangles up too much. I, w I know, I wish there was a wireless unit for the 8KX, but unfortunately at this time it's not possible. Anyway, with this cable you can run the 8KX and also any other Pimax headset for that matter and probably also the HP Reverb or Valve Index as well as the 8K+, Plus, 5K+, Plus, 5K Super and the 8KX with, with native and upscale mode. Now you might be thinking, when you're extending the Pimax cables, you might be aware of that the 8KX unit specifically are no longer using external power. Now this unit has a speci specified special cable which runs two USB cables and one display port, which means both of these USB cables must be connected to your PC because it gets power to the headset through those two USB cables. And the cables I've been now for this test has been the Amazon Basics cables, which are available for around like five or six dollars each, which is really cheap actually. So what you will need is one of these cables, either two meters or three meters extension, and also a two or three extension of the, here they are by the way, <laughs> the cables which are USB 3.0. But remember one thing, I have not found any DisplayPort or mini DisplayPort to DisplayPort adapter which actually is working with this cable yet. So for laptops, I'm gonna try another cable which I still haven't tried, which also is made by Club 3D. And I will try this cable if it works to extend at least one meter from the laptop. Because all laptops or basically every laptop on the market uses a mini display port output instead of a normal full size display port output. And I know you haven't got your 8KX yet, either if you are a backer of the 8KX or if you just pre-order it like now or maybe like a month ago. But still, if you want this cable, hurry up to get it. It's available on Amazon, both in United States, in UK, in Germany, France, Italy, and I will include the links to the Amazon pages, both in Europe and United States for both the Club 3D DisplayPort cables and also to those Amazon Basics <laughs> USB 3.0 extension cables. $6 a cable, I think it's great, good enough at least. So if you wanna buy these cables now already before your 8KX arrives, just check out the video description down here below and it will give you the links to all those cables in United States, UK, Germany, Italy, France and whatever. And yes, these are actually affiliate links. So if you would like to support me with like a cup of coffee for your purchase, please use the links down here below. Now, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and if you would like to buy these cables, use my links down here below to support me. I spent like $200 on my own, from my own pocket, to actually try out different kind of cables. And finally, I found this one. As a disclaimer, yes, I am a Pimax employee as well. I'm the European Marketing Director of Pimax, but I'm still doing unbiased videos and you can expect reviews and other hints and tricks and topics about Pimax and other VR headsets coming up here on Sweeviver. Thank you so much for watching, guys. See you in the next one. Cheers.